Let's take you now to the United Nations General Assembly, where Nigeria has re-echoed its call for a permanent seat at the United Nations Security Council and also calls for a new global financial pact. Nigeria's statement at the UN was read by Vice President Kashim Shetima. TV Sunday News State House correspondent Femi Akonde has details. Vice President Kashim Shetima reads the national statement of Nigeria on behalf of President Bola Tinubu. He echoed Nigeria's position on the global action against existential challenges faced by the international community. Nigeria has called on world leaders to recommit themselves to multilateralism by deepening relations among member states of the United Nations in line with the principles of inclusivity, equality and cooperation. We are particularly mindful of the imperatives achieving the ad advancement of youth and women as a factor in national development, peace and security. Nigeria has developed its own national action plan on women and security, as well as a national action plan on youth, peace and security to ensure the participation of both women and youth in the peace and security sector. As the chairman of ECOWAS, President Tinubu's statement read by the VP called global attention to the gale of unconstitutional takeover of government in Africa, which highlights the need to support poor countries economically to ensure peace and stability. Nigeria also made a case for poor and developing countries by calling for reforms in the global financial architecture that most often favors the wealthy and powerful countries by strangulating poor and disadvantaged countries with stringent debt repayment conditions. We must ensure that any reform of the international financial system includes comprehensive debt relief measures to enable sustainable financing for development. Countries of the global south cannot make meaningful economic progress without special concessions and a review of their current debt burden. This time around, Nigeria is leading the charge with a bold statement for a reform of the UN Security Council to grant permanent seats to Nigeria and other African countries. Nigeria is urging the United Nations to galvanize global support in tackling the root cause of conflict, which includes poverty, hunger, inequality and exclusion, as well as other forms of injustice. Nigeria insists the box stops on the table of the United Nations if indeed there is a determination and shared responsibility to make the world a better place. Femi Akonde, TVC News, New York.